Hey guys, welcome back to my channel again. This is Mukesh Kumar, and I'm gonna show you how to create page view controller in a particular view controller. As you can see, uh, this is the existing view controller, and in this particular portion, I want to show page view controller. So for that, we need to create a simple project. So just minimize this and create new Xcode project. Under iOS template, choose single view application. Click on next. And here you can give page control demo. And you can name it as any name. And language is objective C and uncheck all these options click on next and just create it right now just go to the main storyboard and here this is your default view controller that existing one and here you have some different color of the view let's say this one as I have taken and two buttons uh, were already there so I am taking the buttons like so and changing its color background color to some blue color and its text as white right just copy and paste another button and align it like this the first button will be log, log in and second button is sign up I haven't added any functionality in this buttons but for the UI I have taken these buttons then next what we need to take is I need to take the container view with the help of container view we can embed page view controller in a particular portion this is the container view and you can drop it in the middle like so and resize it like this and then i need to take yeah this is the another view controller created on the basis of container view and this will be our page view controller so just delete this and take page view controller like this and just try and drop using control button and click on embed like so right and next you need to take the view controller and that will be your page content view controller so here i'm searching view controller this is the normal view controller which will be the page content view controller right and i need to create new class for this by pressing command and n select iOS and then copartage class click on next and you can give the name page view controller subclass will be UI page view controller page view controller and then click next and create and these files are created and then again go to the main dot storyboard select this page view controller and go to the identity inspector and associate that class just you have created that is page view controller next we need to create another class for this view controller so just press command button with n again click on next and the subclass of will be ui view controller and this will be the 
content view controller or you can say page content just click on next and create again go to main.storyboard click on this view controller and associate the content view controller class right now what we need to do is as I have already created a video for page view controller I will mention the link for the, that video in the description below of this video so you can also view whole the video of page view controller and can also download the project so I just need to copy and paste the code for that and just copy and paste the page view controller class like so in the video of page view controller I have described each of the line and I have also shared the blog on my uh, website as well as blog site now select the .m file and select from here again copy and paste in .m file like so right so in .h file no error in .m file we need to manipulate some of the things like I need to import content view controller class yes and I have taken an array of name devices and these are the images iPhone, iPad, iPod Touch so I need to import these images also in this assets folder so just click on this and go to your source path and just take that images and just drag it to your assets folder like so just go to dot in file of page view controller again yeah and here is the error of page view controller right so just leave the code as it is and go to the content view controller dot h file now we need to copy paste some of the codes just close this and in this we need to copy the code from this view controller.h I need to copy these three lines of code below above are the properties for label and image so I will declare the property for image manually let's first create it go to main.storyboard now we need to show the images for that I need to take the image view object in the content view controller you can set it like so and give it constraints from all, corner, all corners add four constraints now create the property by clicking on this assistant editor and this is the content view controller class dot h file where we need to declare the property pressing control button drag to this file like so and you can name it as device image images or you can say device image that's it just go back to the content view controller.h file and now you can copy this code as you can see star label so I don't need any label so just delete this property and now just go to m file and copy this portion paste it in m file like so and here I don't need this label copy and all now 
you can see uh, I have taken device image as the name of that image view property so here I need to change that name and that will be device image I need to change this name actually content view controller and this will be the content view controller and this is also the content view controller now all okay in this class now go to the page view controller dot h in .m file you need to find rectify these others as this is content view controller we need to also change the name here we already did okay again the same change I don't need this star level so just delete this and this is also the content view controller yeah I need to set this identifier to instantiate so just copy this identifier and paste it go to the storyboard select the content view controller and set it here enter just go back page view controller button now this will be written type of content view controller button we see is okay so now all errors are rectified this should be of type content view controller now all perfect choose the simulator as iphone 7 and you can run yeah so this is your output images are something stressed and when you swipe it down so it is showing curl type so for that we need to make some changes just go to main.storyboard and select this page view controller the attribute inspector transition style will be the scroll and by selecting your image view you can set its content mode to aspect Let's again run this project and see the effect. Now, this looks good. So you can swipe down the images. It is working fine. So this is your page view controller using container view to show page view controller in a particular portion of existing view controller so i hope this video is helpful to you and you enjoyed this video if you like this video so don't forget to hit like button and subscribe my channel for any query you can also comment below thank you bye bye see you in the next video Whatever I see, I'll remember 